Hi everybody, I am Pratik Dua from Pratik Dua Photography and I am back with another interview. Today we have a real, real artist with us who is an excellent abstract painter. Her work has been featured in various exhibitions and big fat rich Indians are her main clientele. I will be giving the link of her Instagram handle as well as her website so you guys can check her work. So hi Shelly, how are you? Hi, I am good, thank you. Okay, uh, so Shelly, first question that I would like to ask you is what was your education background and how did you get into abstract painting? Well, I did my education from Delhi University okay. and then uh, I just continued in art. I never actually gave up on my uh, passion. Okay. This is the greatest passion in me and yeah. it's, it's like ch since childhood I'm doing it. Okay. And uh, abstract painting is basically, you know, expression of, you know, beauty hmm. or love. I show always uh, kind of, you know, love and some expression of art, mm -hmm. right? So Shelly, I would like to ask you, what is basically abstract painting and how different is it from other forms of painting okay. briefly so that a listener can understand this art form? Alright, so basically I am a professional abstract artist. I really use art to express myself, to connect deeper with the world around me. So let's get into the question, why abstract and what is abstract? I personally believe and I feel that like it, it's the most expressive art, you are not so concentrated not so focused on making things so perfect all the time it's more about the process and about just experience in itself rather than outcome there are million things that i wish i knew at the beginning of my journey the first one of those would be it just experiment abstract is an experiment allow yourself to ruin paintings allow yourself to punch a painting or rip it or whatever it you hate abstract art is basically expression creating abstract art can be very fun and rewarding but it can also be incredibly challenging mm -hmm. uh, basically when uh, challenging is when you know someone asks you to create a painting replica mm -hmm. like i have made this painting by yeah. myself and yeah. if someone wants to you know uh, create the painting same so exactly. it becomes challenging because uh. you are playing with the colors yeah. but if someone asks you just copy it, it is not possible. Mm -hmm. So I just ask my clients, clients, just uh, you have to see my work and then yeah. get it into it. Okay. And uh, in abstract painting, I think it, something challenging would also be because you can't replicate the same colors. Probably the color right. you got it today, tomorrow that color you might not be able to repeat right. it. Yeah. So that thing also happens with you. Yeah, exactly. So following with that question, Shelly, uh, how much time does it take to make a painting? Depends actually upon the you know painting size as well as the theme which okay. the client gives me. Sometimes okay. they want you know feather painting with some abstract colors, flash, and sometimes they ask me like some uh, floral kind of design. But even then they want some abstract in that. So it depends upon the painting to painting. Sometimes okay. I create one painting in one month, okay. or it goes longer sometimes. Okay. Yeah. It takes that long yeah. also. And uh, does it also depends upon the size of the canvas also? Yeah, exactly. Size, design, everything. Uh, so Shelly, how does your client uh, tell you what exactly they are looking for? I ask them for the pictures basically, interior pictures. Okay, of their like, house? Uh, yeah, exactly. Of their house, offices, residential purposes. Like, okay. Uh, Sometimes I paint for the clinics also, hospitals okay. also. Yeah, right? yeah. So I ask them to do the video call and or they send me the pictures of their okay. uh, drawing room or any any other part of the house. Okay. So in this way, uh, the client understand my you know my art also, and I understand their interior so that I can just make a beautiful painting for yeah. them. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so Shelly, uh, what is the first reaction of people when you tell them that you are an artist? Ah. <laughs> uh, once I went into a job in Amity University and okay. uh, she was the, the girl became my fir uh, first friend there and she told me that she created some artwork right okay. she showed me her work and then I showed her my work she was like quite surprised and she became so happy that you are at good level Shelly and you're doing since a long time mm -hmm. and she she was like uh, quite surprised to see okay. my work yeah so I think people especially my parents Mm. are proud of me and okay. uh, my husband also so i okay. believe that yes uh, i am doing the thing which i always wanted to do right right yeah. you're following your passion basically yeah. Yeah. everyone is supportive and uh, they they actually you know motivate me also right, sometimes right. 
I get like feel like no, uh, I should do something else also with the mm-hmm. art. But no, it's not like that. They are supportive and motivate me also every time. That's lovely. That's lovely because I think Shelly, ki uh, art ki koi value nahi hai. You can't put a price on a an on an art basically. Yeah, price. It case. it can be sold at like twenty thousand. It can be, that same painting can be for somebody else. It could be two lakh also. Right. And you're doing great. I saw your work and your profile and I even went through your website and that is how I contacted you. uh shelly uh is there anybody in your family who is uh, an artist or is remotely fond of painting yes my sister one of my sister yeah. actually started uh, doing the art since i think her school time maybe okay and uh, she started going to the art class and uh, just like uh, watching her because of her i think i continued my art also so she motivated you yeah exactly okay. she always appreciated me mm-hmm. if uh, even if i'm just making one line she always said yes you're doing good way okay. so i think uh, motivation and appreciation is both the things are important yeah, exactly for an artist even in the field of dance or any mm-hmm. any field of i arts. think support yeah. to an artist is very important because uh, this right. is not a very conventional kind of a job and people don't really appreciate it or they basically look down right ye hobby hai to kar raha hai to koi baat nahi they're not looked at as a profession but agar jab support milta hai it really motivates you and it pushes you ki nahi we can do more in this thing and i think that and is you feel really happy yeah. when you convert the passion into profession yeah. and i think hobby should always be there hmm. because uh, ऑब्वियसली कोई भी प्रोफेशन है वो पहले ही हॉबी ही होता है ठीक है उसको कन्वर्ट करने के लिए आपको बहुत ज्यादा मेहनत करनी पड़ती है यू बिकम योर ओन यू नो एडवर्टाइजर एंड यू बिकम योर ओन बिजनेस या एग्जैक्टली यू बिकम योर ओन प्लानर एंड यू क्रिएट योर ओन यू नो ऑर्गेनाइजेशन सो अ लॉट ऑफ थिंग्स आर देयर विच पीपल डोंट नो पीपल थिंक कि हम लोग बस पेंटिंग करते हैं बट apart from that there are many things which we do for you know uh, completing our work matlab bahut sara kuch karna padta hai yeah yeah aap bhi photographer ho aapko bhi pata hai sab kuch bahut mehnat lagti hai bahut mehnat lagti hai pata hai maza aata hai matlab ek artist ko na ye sab work karne mein bahut matlab wo aapko kaam nahi lagta ha kaam nahi lagta hum like raat mein bhi kaam kar sakte hain din mein bhi kaam kar sakte hain like i do job as well i do job in the school and then i come to the uh, home. Uh, as a school you have um, i am a creative head okay and apart from that i when i come from the school then i do uh, i give the art class as well okay. online right now online art class is going on okay okay apart from that then i do my art works for the clients so like and i do murals also okay yeah mural paintings so there are the things and we don't feel you know uh, um, like tired sometimes yeah, yeah. तो ये होता है कि आप पूरी रात भी काम करते हो दिन में काम करते हो फील्स वेरी फुलफिलिंग फुलफिलिंग एंड सेटिस्फाइड सेटिस्फाइड नींद अच्छी आती है हां एंड जब क्लाइंट को अच्छा लग जाए ना आपका आर्ट वर्क वो सबसे ज्यादा मतलब उससे ज्यादा हैप्पीनेस कुछ नहीं होती सम टाइम इवन मनी से भी ज्यादा हैप्पीनेस वो क्लाइंट के चेहरे पे जो खुशी होती है दैट गिव्स डेफिनेटली थोड़ा सा लाइट क्वेश्चन रखते हैं सो शैली हु बॉट योर फर्स्ट पेंटिंग एंड व्हाट डिड यू डू विद दैट मनी अह actually uh, that was a portrait of someone's okay. uh, grandfather okay. and actually i used to make portraits earlier okay. Uh, okay. for many years i did portrait and mm. for the clients for the first time i did the portrait and that money was just 1500 rupees okay. and that was i think uh, very much for me mm-hmm. that time na yeah, like yeah. 10 years before ha ha aaj bhi so <laughs> yes <laughs> so that 1500 bucks was like oh my god i earned that yeah. no to वो सेटिस्फेक्शन तो मुझे लाइक like, बहुत ही अलग सा फील हुआ कि मैंने right. वो अर्न किया एंड आफ्टर दैट आई कंटिन्यू डेट एंड पीपल लाइक मुझे थोड़ा सा एक्स्ट्रा मेहनत करना पड़ा क्योंकि आई एम नॉट इनटू आर्ट बेसिकली फ्रॉम लाइक एजुकेशन सो मुझे uh, खुद को ही लर्न कराना पड़ा आई मीन आई एम सेल्फ टॉट आर्टिस्ट इवन दो आई हैव लर्न फ्रॉम मेनी आर्टिस्ट बट इवन देन आई फील लाइक कि हाँ जब आप एजुकेशन नहीं लेते हो किसी भी फील्ड uh, में एंड देन यू कम इन टू दैट फील्ड तो दैट टाइम आई थिंक आपको ज्यादा मेहनत करनी पड़ती है ठीक है तो आई kept learning matlab maine okay. kabhi na choda nahi to aapne education mein background mein aapne kya kiya i did bcom and i am come from delhi university acha okay yeah it was not related to art at all no 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 to ye kab interest aapka jaaga is interest to mera schooling and when did you find when did you find out that you are capable of doing something like this uh, actually bahut na passionate thi okay ah uh, matlab main 
दिन रात ना बस वो स्केचिंग पेंसिल okay. लेकर के कहीं भी बैठ जाना है घर के कॉर्नर में एंड देन आई कैप डूइंग इट है ना तो लाइक पापा यूज टू से आईज खराब हो जाएगी क्यों कर रही है ये है ना तो बट आई थॉट कि यार बोलने दो ठीक है ठीक है पेरेंट्स सही सलाह देते हैं बट इवन देन आई फेल्ट लाइक कि नहीं मुझे करना है तो करना है मुझे इसी में और ये मैंने सोचा जब मैं स्कूल में ही थी आई वॉज वेरी क्लियर और आप जब क्लियर होते हो तो आप अपने विजन को बहुत इजीली यस अचीव कर सकते हो अपने गोल को जो भी आपका गोल है वो आप इजीली अचीव कर पाते हो तो क्लियर होना बेसिकली मुझे लगता है बहुत इम्पोर्टेंट है कि आपको क्या करना है लाइफ में तो मैं अपने स्टूडेंट्स को स्कूल में भी इवन मैं बोलती हूँ कि आपको क्लियर होना चाहिए इफ यू आर इन ट्वेल्थ स्टैंडर्ड इलेवेंथ स्टैंडर्ड तो मेरे को लगता है कि हाँ क्लियर अगर होंगे आप तो आप ऑब्वियसली कुछ भी अचीव कर पाएंगे तो आई आल्सो वांट टू आस्क यू डस एवरी एब्सट्रैक्ट पेंटिंग मींस डिफरेंट टू डिफरेंट पीपल यस ऑफ कोर्स यू नो वन कलर सिंबलाइज डिफरेंट मीनिंग्स लाइक अ रेड कलर कैन बी कैन सिंबलाइज लव एंड टू सम अदर पर्सन इट कैन बी एंगर सो इट डिपेंड्स अपॉन पर्सन टू पर्सन एंड देयर इमोशंस ओके If I am happy, so I create, you know, I sketch the sketches. Okay. So I create happy mood of girl painting. Okay. And if I am not happy, so obviously वो colors डल आ जाते हैं और emotions होते हैं ना वो डल ही होते हैं. तो एक artist बनाने वाले का भी emotions important है and देखने वाले के भी emotions emotions important है. Because the same person probably one day can see that painting is a happy painting and some other day his mood is little bad. Right. वो कुछ और interpret हो सकता है. Right. Right. Wow, this is so difficult art form. Right. Yeah. Malab, how can you satisfy somebody uh, because you don't know his emotions at that present moment, and uh, your emotions are equally important yes, at the exactly. time of painting. Yes, exactly, exactly, exactly. Which must be really difficult. So, इसलिए like uh, when I teach my students online class, so I ask them just do two minutes meditation. Okay. Give your yourself time and अपने आप को थोड़ा calm mood में रखो and uh, sit in a like. इन अ वे सो दैट आप आराम से कम्फर्टेबली वर्क कर सको मीन्स कम्फर्ट जोन भी बहुत जरूरी है आर्टिस्ट के लिए सो शानी हेज एट एवर हैपन दैट इन योर ड्रीम सबकॉन्शियसली यू ट्रेम्प ऑफ सम डिजाइन और यू सॉ सम डिजाइन इन यूर हेड एंड वेन यू वर्क अप यू थॉट दैट आई शुड मेक समथिंग लाइक दिस नॉट इन ड्रीम बट एक्सैक्टली यस वेन आई एम सिटिंग इन द नेचर एंड आई एम वॉचिंग द क्लाउड्स ओके और आई एम sitting in front of me. there is wall which is having cracks okay. or some dust so i see really i see and okay. it's it's really happening to me since 10 years okay that i see faces oh, and and it happens me. it really happens sometimes a uh, full body of the girl or i can see some faces of the girls it happens to me even now you're so, scaring me a little bit <laughs> <laughs> so it happens to me and uh, आई थिंक ये कोई भी जो आर्टिस्ट है ना वो सभी के साथ मुझे लगता है होता ही होगा यू कैन सी इन माई पेंटिंग आई कैन सी सम फेसेस बट आई डोंट नो अबाउट यू दैट यू कैन सी सम फेसेस देयर आर नॉट शैली हैव यू एवर बीन इमोशनली अटैच्ड टू अ पेंटिंग इतना ज्यादा दैट यू डिडंट फील लाइक सेलिंग इट यस इट हैपन टू मी व्हेन आई वाज क्रिएटिंग पेंटिंग फॉर द स्कूल्स देयर वाज थीम बेस्ड बेसिकली एंड द थीम वाज द गर्ल Okay. And it's education. So I actually was creating those paintings in a detailed form. Okay. When you give a lot of time, like one month, two months, it can be three months. Hmm. So uh, that moment when you you know uh, give a lot of time to one painting, you get hmm. attachment. I understand. And uh, sometimes so yes, ये वाली painting है मैंने बनाई हुई है. So I don't never want to sell it. <laughs> it's really. very beautiful to me and to my husband as well right right no it is actually very beautiful yeah thank you i steal it ah <laughs> <laughs> uh, shali who is your inspiration behind abstract painting well uh, of course i take inspiration from nature okay and uh, nature is the most important part for every artist i believe mm. and hum log sab kuch jo dekhte hain wahi hum apne you know canvas pe dalte hain तो जब मैं कैनवस पे कलर्स डाल रही होती हूँ तो ऑब्वियसली आई स्टील कलर्स फ्रॉम द नेचर एंड यू नो आई जस्ट प्ले विद द कलर्स बेसिकली राइट सो इंस्पिरेशन इज ऑब्वियसली फ्रॉम द नेचर एंड फ्रॉम एक्सपीरियंस एंड आई एक्सपेरिमेंट लॉट ऑफ यू नो विद थिंग्स डिफरेंट डिफरेंट टूल्स 
Uh, actually, I think we have uh, touched down upon this topic, so I just want to uh, talk about this in a little more brief. Uh, do you feel in India people don't take art or artists seriously and they're probably mostly looked at as a hobby? Aapka yes, salakta? of course. Many, many people have, you know, uh, uh, pinpointed me that why are you doing it and you can't, you know, earn from this. And I, I just, I had no idea that why we, these people, you know, uh, talk about these kind of things. Because I believe in myself. Right. I believe in my skills. Hmm. And then I thought that I should just focus on my work instead of thinking what other people are thinking. Mm-hmm. Every artist should think like this right. so that they can, you know, consistently work right. and consistently improve on right. their work right. instead of just what other people are thinking. Uh, so Shelly, uh, as you mentioned earlier that you teach uh, painting online also. So how do you teach the students and uh, from where can people learn uh, painting from you? Well, uh, after like Kurra, I started my online uh, class and uh, okay. from like very small age to like above level, like adults also can learn from me and mm-hmm. uh, the courses are like certificate course I am providing okay. of fine arts. So, uh, they can start like they can register from uh, online itself. I okay. will be sending you the link. Sure, I'll put that link and, in the description uh, box yeah, also. I have website shella.com or right. uh, they can uh, the people can visit to my IG uh, Instagram handle. Right. Uh, that is Shelly Bama the artist. Yeah. So they can see my work from there and otherwise they can Google on my my work okay. Shelly Bama the artist. Yeah. Okay, and uh, if somebody wants to buy paintings of yours, and how can they see your work on your website only? Yeah, exactly. And basically, what are you? Who are your main clientele? My main clientele, obviously, fat rich people. Okay. And uh, yes, because uh, painting take a lot of time. It's not right. print. Basically, yeah. people get confused between the print and the painting. And yeah. I, this thing, I actually wanted to tell people that print is something you know you take out print. Right. Okay? right. And painting is handmade right. which is being created by the artist hmm. so i believe that people should understand the difference between both of them so print can be duplicated also yeah they exactly. can take five and prints artist, of it yeah, six art, prints. artwork is original and sometimes it can be replica it depends upon the client also like sometimes client give me the design okay. so it can be like replica also okay so yes so Shelly, it was really nice to meet you and we had a great time, great chat. I also get to learn about abstract painting, which I was, wasn't was aware. And thank you for welcoming us to your beautiful house and we saw your beautiful work in, in person. Uh, so thank you so much. Thank you so much for the interview and uh, you are a great photographer. So really, I wish all the best to you also. I wish you the same as well. Uh, guys, please subscribe to this channel and share it as much as possible. Thank you. Thank you so much.